generation have had to listen to such tales from their fathers. It's been 20 years. 20 years ago, Carragher was a seven-year-old fan, an Everton fan. It's quite a breezy night in Istanbul. The wind blows down a, a, over an open stand to your left, left to right. Liverpool are playing into it in the first half. Once upon a time, there was always an English team in the Europe. But Liverpool are pacing some Vebe. Free kick which Andrea Pirlo will take. And it's full in, and it's in! A goal in 50 seconds for Milan. Oh, would you believe it? Paolo Maldini, the skipper, has scored it. Only once in the history of the European Cup final has there been a... Gerard again. Swung it towards Hapia! Straight at Dina. Great response from Liverpool. Really is. They've got themselves on the ball. They're great. A couple of chances. Pirlo will take the corner. Liverpool in trouble again, and Hoppe just tries to hook it clear and rather fortuitously slices it back into the hands oh. for him. Seydorf takes, oh, and it's turned off the line this time by Luis Garcia. Hoppe trying to clear it, down with a shot. Critical kick it was, it was Crespo pinning off the near post. Yeah, he's done very, very well there. I think Steven Gerrard's just ball watching a little bit, Crespo nips in front, it's a great flick. Cafu arriving from the right. Toss back in, and it's a header from Kaka, the two main long striding Brazilian options left and right. It's found a way to Shevchenko, there's a flag out, it won't count. It won't count. Andrew Shevchenko celebrates. Put your back. that's been denied the protection of Harman and Bischan tonight. Here's Luis Garcia tried to turn now. Did Maldini handle that? Certainly Luis Garcia felt so. And there's about 20,000 Liverpool fans behind that. Lifted into Shevchenko, he's onside this time, he's got Crespo in support. Here's Ernan Crespo, 2-0. Oh. Ernan Crespo, who scored home and away against Manchester United earlier in the competition, has now scored the second in the final against Liverpool. But, but, seconds before, Liverpool had a strong penalty appeal, turned down at the other end. Risa. It's coached in towards Barros. It'll come here for Smeetzer to hit. Now, Barros has already been penalised. Maybe the ball struck his arm. It'd be rather ironic if that was the decision. That really, you know, he, he thought Garcia was going to go down the line. Look at that from Kaká. Oh. And what a pass too for Crespo. And oh, what a goal that is. Oh. What a goal that is. In and Crespo again from the sublime pass by Kaká. And Milan now playing football out of this world. Nobody can live with this. Wonderful, wonderful goal. From Ernan Crespo of Chelsea. <laughs> oh, that is absolutely fantastic. That really is again. One come. Here's Cafu, captain of that team. Oh, it's come off Dudek. It's fallen for Crespo. It's back to Cafu. It's hit Herpier. Xabi Alonso. It's ambitious. It's well struck. Oh, it wasn't far away. Happy to strike, that is. Just as he was teeing it up to have a strike, I was actually pretty I cannot afford that. Here goes Kaka again with Shevchenko to his right. Kaka may go it alone. Was he caught by Herpia? Yes, he was. Pirlo, Seydorf, Shevchenko! Good oh. save! I don't know how much Jetsy do that saw that, but he threw himself away to his left to deny Andrew Shevchenko. Hell of a strike drive as well, because by the time he got to the ball, Shevchenko, there's two players virtually on top. Charged down by Cafu. In towards Gerard. Hello. Hello. Here we go. Steven Gerard puts a grain of doubt in the back of Milan minds and gives hope to all the many thousands of Liverpool fans. Xavi Alonso. Harman. Hit by Smitzer. It's in! It's in! Vladimir Smitzer! Two minutes for Liverpool. <laughs> Miracles are possible. Unbelievable stuff, Bob. It really is. Good patient build-up, Hamad.
to Smith. He doesn't really get closed down quick enough. Goalkeeper. Goalkeeper's dived and dived over. Big. Carragher into Barros. He's laid it off. It's Gerard. He was held. He's given the penalty. He's given the penalty. Well, he has picked Liverpool up by the scruff of the neck. Good hit. That's where they've now got to concentrate, Liverpool. You've got yourselves right back in. Motley like this since the early days of Real Madrid. Barisa with a shot. Dino with the save. Everything Liverpool hit now raining in on the Brazilian goalkeeper. Now Kaka slipping in behind Xabi Alonso and Dudek's oh. lost it. And here's Shevchenko. Oh, head off the line by Traore. What a rescue by Jimmy Traore. Jersey Dudek, the most relieved man in the stadium. Pizza. Turned away by Stam. Here's Luis Garcia into the path of Steven Gerrard. That's where we want to see him. That's what he does best. Everywhere. You can't just have Steven Gerrard just sitting alongside Javi Alonso. Javi Alonso. Luis Garcia. Seedorf. He tried to shield the ball. Luis Garcia whipped him out of the way and was penalised. Just like to have seen the Liverpool players oh, actually. Away from Herpia, Andrei Shevchenko in towards there, and Crespo has got two in support, he's pulled it back and Kaka is there, but so is Jamie Carragher. What a tackle, Brilliant. what a tackle. Fantastic tackle. Well, you have just witnessed 90 of the most gripping minutes of European football you will ever, ever see. But the good news is there's more to come. And for the 13th time, the European Cup final goes into... Extra time. Taking a five-man defence here. Serginho curled in towards Thomason. It was a real chance. Traore missed it that time. And Jon Dahl Thomason missed the chance. It's a fabulous ball in for from Serginho. I really, I'm not sure if Jimmy. He's dug out across. Shevchenko is there with the volley. Serginho has kept it in. Oh, it's a dangerous ball, and Karen oh. just managed to get a toe. He's get something on the so other brave. Way. Corner taken by Rui Costa. And it was curling. Oh, Do he tried to reach it. I think Luis Garcia knew better and got out of the way. He's to the lottery of the shootout. Sergio oh. with a great cross. Thomason! Oh. oh, what a save! What a, what a save from Shevchenko by Jesse Dudek. Jersey, I apologise. What a stop that first one. And the second one, he doesn't know. It's laid back to Jon Arnorisa. And it's charged down by Andriy Shevchenko. And it will be a penalty shootout. It's an unjust way, in many respects, to settle such an unbelievable football match. But nothing else could separate Liverpool and Milan in the end. And for the eighth time in the 50... Serginho with the first penalty for Milan. Oh, oh! Not even close. Not even close. Harman to give Liverpool the advantage. Oh, that'll do. Get him. <laughs> that'll do nicely. A heroic save in him. It's Pirlo. Oh. He's done it! Terrific stop. Pirlo tried to deceive him. With us, Gibral Cisse. 2 0. Brilliant. Thomason. He scored. Oh. Milan off the mark. Room for error for Milan. If Jon Arnorisa can hit the back of the net. Oh, but Dina reached it. Threw himself down to his right and just managed to divert it round the post. The Brazilian Kaka. Dudek with a bit of the grovel on wobbly legs. Fired into the roof of the net by Kaka. 2-2 in the shootout. Well, the Liverpool still hold. It's Schmitzer. Match point Liverpool. 
great penalty. There will be no second chances if Shevchenko misses. He saved it! The European Cup is returning to England and to Anfield. Liverpool are champions of Europe again. The most extraordinary night of football has a most extraordinary finish. Andriy Shevchenko, who won the trophy. Liverpool have their hands on the European Cup again. And this time it's for Keats. That trophy isn't going anywhere but Anfield. had 18 of those from their Champions League campaign. Both had to qualify and score three times each in doing so. What will separate them here? Certainly not been sweltering in Athens. There's, I suppose, a bit of heavy air around the place. More humidity than perhaps Liverpool would be used to on Merseyside, but they would have had some of that probably in their Spanish training camp last week. Was Maldini. Ooh, and Gantelowski couldn't do that. Here's Pennant, goalkeeper saves, did up. And Nesta helped the goalkeeper out. And that's a very good hit from Jimmy Pennant. Angle against him, scoring. But he walked the goalkeeper. And Koloski's mistake. Kaká, and that's good hands by Pepe Reina. And that is good hands because it goes down early for the shot and it sits up. Well, there's a there's a hero from yeah. two years ago, but he's only the backup goalkeeper now. Jersey Dudek, of course, one of them on the ball. It's reached to Gerard, who can hit them from uh, that sort of range so well. Maybe just rush it a little, Stephen. Even great players can do it. He wants it early. The hand goes up, signal goes up, gets decent score, a Champions League goal. Comes out to Alonso. Got the uh, Liverpool fans behind that goal uh, up on their toes. He just drags it a little. But this is the best passage of play for Liverpool. Risa, who loves to shoot, loves to shoot. Sometimes his teammates go on about him. Uh, it might be a, a pass that he doesn't spot, but when he's got a, a hammer like his, it's just a The slip by Jankulowski. Pennant got in. Gerard, his count! Dida out to try and prevent the corner. And he's done it. He's got how good a chance and how much. Half clearance by Carragher. That's a free kick to Milan. Just again, they were guilty of Liverpool just giving the ball away cheaply when they had possession. He's looking for this. He's thinking, get my body in front of the ball. And as soon as there's contact, I'll take note of a great return from him. This talent. Shudoff obviously interesting. But it is Pillar! And Inzaghi may well have touched it in, judging by his reaction. You know, you just. Lambrosini. Kaka. Risa! Much like Alonso. Face of the ball is always asking away from goal. He wants to just cut fresh and life up. Even that's a bad, bad ball. Gerard, oh, a touch there by Count Ala Inzaghi, and it could have been one-one. Oh, Pillow's blaming the ref. Edge for Milan, not marked. And one of them is Clarence Seidorf. Get it back to Kuehl. Inzaghi. Pick his uh, position. That's <laughs> nice part defended reasonably comfortably and might add to it here with Inzaghi again. That might just make them kings of Europe for a seventh time. Two for Pippo Inzaghi. So if anyone's deserving, you know, of this Milan side, it's probably him. Because he's gone on his own up there time and time and time again with nothing to support him. And the third of it, Kaka, the one thing that. Here's Crouch. Not a bad try at all, and it's a 
corner tipped over by Dida. Meta. Giladino. Agas in there. And the header by Dirk Count. His first Champions League goal. Has it come in time? Oh, hold on to your hearts. Kindled. Hold on to your hearts. I don't want you to say it's over. Lovely little help on it in the post. It does get a deflection. Question of offside here. Milan had their revenge in Athens. Thanks to Pippo Inzaghi. After two years of agonising over Istanbul. Two what. Inzaghi goals. Final. Uh, raw tears to English eyes in the final. Damn.